I don't know if you've noticed, but there's a secret here. If you go to the right, you can say hello to Wrinkly. Hi, I'm Game Guy. It's time for more Let's Play Donkey Kong Country 3. Wrinkly is asleep yet again. This lady can just not stay awake for the life of her. It's a sad existence, but I mean, she's old. I guess to be fair, you know, a good sleep is always fun. Tear away toboggan. I wasn't expecting this level yet, but I guess here we are. If I remember right, that is a way that you can die in this level, <laughs> by the way. Um, I was remembering slightly wrong. There's a thing here. I know that there is. Oh, okay, I understand. I need to... Okay, there's a bonus barrel. I'm pretty sure if you aim that downward. Not, like, directly downward, but, like, at a downward angle. It's, it's what I'm trying to say. Um, so this is like that one level from the tube land, except there's no upper railing and I missed the K. Um, so there is that. Uh, I believe, if I remember right, you can fall in a pit to die. It's a thing that you can do. This level is like a significant up in difficulty, though, compared to the last. Uh, so, uh, you know. There it is. Alright. See, I, I knew there was a barrel there somewhere. Oh, okay. I, I understand the gimmick here. The gimmick here is I need to throw Dixie up at the bugs. It's a thing that you can do, although it really doesn't ever come into play, to, to be fair. Um, anyway... Now that I got that out of the way, let's see if I can t cannot beat the level again. Beating the level is a thing that I wish to do. It's funny, because we had an ice level already. Well, snow, I guess. A snow level. We had one of these already back in World 1. So it's a little weird that there was one of those there and not being the first time here, I, I don't know. That jump is tricky, because I keep landing on the bug, and it it makes me, you know, land elsewhere. I don't know. I don't know, man. Dixie, you probably shouldn't be going downhill with your mouth open as such. It, I, you know, I don't even need to jump there, because I kind of just slide down the, the, the slanted groundscape. I miss the K. For some reason, that is a very difficult K to get. I don't understand why, but I finally made it past that jump so I could die to that B. Exactly as planned. Maybe one of these days I will finally make it to a land where I can be known as the one with the progress. Uh, but sadly, that time has not arrived. I needed to jump the- This is all a memory game in a way, in that I have to remember where it is I need to jump, and where it is I need to not jump. And then specifically where it is I need to jump to land on a dude so that I can end up in a per in an optimal position. It's a very confusing state of affairs, and also it is snowing very hard, which makes it difficult to see I didn't see that pit in time, so I fell into it. This is just the level where I'm going to lose all of my balloons, evidently. I, I don't know about you, but my balloons are floating away at a very particularly fast rate. It's, it's a very unfortunate situation that we've got going on here, but I mean, to be fair, this toboggan is just not cooperating in the slightest. I mean, if it would just slow down even the slightest bit, one would be able to make a quick judgment call on, on whatever it is they need to make a judgment call on. It, just, it seems like a good thing. Let's jump this time. Jumping is good. You should do that on occasion if you wish to live. There's a checkpoint. Finally, we are making it to a land known as Progress. I remember the second bonus in this level is obnoxious, and I don't exactly remember where it is. Okay, well, that was an effective use of a monkey. Like, it's it's somewhere on a lower path. It was right there, actually, up ahead. You couldn't see it yet, but I know that's where it is, because I recognize that formation. But, like, you need to jump in a very particular way so you don't go on top of the house but stay underneath it. It's it's 
weird and I don't particularly care for it, but I mean, it's fine. It's fine. I'm sad I missed the K, but that K is actually kind of slightly difficult to get. I need to do that exactly. Okay. And I also need to not fail this bonus game. That's gonna be easy to do, especially considering I did it already, because I needed to not jump there. Hooray! The snowman still is not approving of me. Oh no, I have accidentally ran into things. Accidentally, of course. How could I have done such a thing, even? I certainly don't know. I do like how when you restart the level from the checkpoint, it, like, um, starts halfway through the song. Also, I felt like I wasn't really in control of most of my actions back there, by the way. Just, uh, thought I'd, uh, put that out there. Uh, for all you folks at home keeping track of, uh, how many times I've narrowly avoided death back there. <laughs> Uh, it, it was a, it's a pretty large number. Stay down this time, and everything will be good. I did it! I beat the level! Well, actually, I didn't beat the level yet, but, uh, I'm about to. See? Level destroyed. Ah, there's the goal, but we all know that the real prize is back here with this dude. Sadly, I don't have my friend Kitty, so I can't, um... I can't figure out what might be uh, over on that upper ledge area, but oh well. It's fine. We made it. Barrel drop bounce. I believe is the level that I thought had secrets everywhere. So this is going to be a fun time. <laughs> uh, the gimmick of this level is that barrels defy physics and go very slowly in water. I'm not really sure what that's about. Okay, here's the question. Is there something over here? The answer is yes, but also no. Okay. Yeah, because I kind of vaguely remember this. Um, it was like coin or a bonus barrel that's just kind of out in the middle of nowhere. And you just kind of have to fall and hope that you land somewhere important. It, it, it's, it's not my favorite secret. I mean, there are hints in that there is a, um, a thing there, uh, but, you know, it's fine. Uh, somewhere... Ah, okay, I see the apparent puzzle here. The puzzle being, I need to throw you upwards so that you go just a little bit slower, and then all is good with the world. Finally. All right. Well, I got that out of the way, so uh, everything is good. The barrels should respawn if you wait long enough, but I think it's just quicker to go off screen slightly. Hey, look, a box. Boxes are pretty rare in this game. They're basically like barrels, except they don't roll. Um, that's pretty much it. I, I, I don't know, it's just a little weird to even see one, to be, to be honest. Because, I mean, they were more ever-present in the second game, it seemed. And in this game, they're just kind of there sometimes, maybe. Is anything up here? No. Seemingly not at all. Ah, yes, I remember this. This is the part where I have to climb the stair of barrels. To where is my question? Was there one to my right at some point that I just failed to see? Is that what was happening there? Oh, okay, I gotta, gotta, I gotta backtrack. Did I just not climb fast enough to do that the normal way or what? Like, I, I don't know, this level's weird. I think, I, I think this is just a weird sort of affair. There's obviously something going on over there. Though, at present, I'm not sure how- Oh, there's a barrel. Uh, I wasn't really expecting that. I was expecting, uh, I don't know, something else. Is there anything? I think I saw something. I did! I saw something for a brief moment, and that was my chance! My chance at victory was at hand! And now we gotta climb the barrel sterile! The sterile barrel stairs. 
That's what this is. There's some slight lag occasionally, and it's kind of thrown me off slightly, but everything worked out, so... It's all good. We're back to here now. I gotta jump from a barrel to another bar- well, alright. Ah, let's try not destroying our bird friend this time. Instead, we will destroy ourselves. But our bird survived, so it's all good. I wonder what was beyond those bees at that earlier part, or if they were just kind of there to say, hey, you shouldn't go this way. Just, just saying. Just saying, you know, that's not a thing you should do. All right, see, I, I, I made it over here that time. I guess you just gotta be quicker. That's really all that there is to it. It's fine. All right, well, uh, let's just jump onto it. I'm not sure why I didn't cut to get here, but it's fine. I made it work. Uh, let's switch to Dixie, because I might... Wah! I didn't mean to do that. Okay, well, I guess I'm not going to be Dixie. I am instead going to be Kitty again, because I just decided casually I wanted to do a hair twirl off the ledge. Obviously, exactly what I intended to do. 100%. You know, I just, I, you don't understand my strategies, okay? You just don't. I lost my bird friend. This will probably come back to bite me, but at the same time, I'm not entirely sure how I was supposed to do that, really, but, okay. Is there anything up here? Nope, does not seem as such. Does not even remotely seem to be the case. Um, I'm a little sad I lost my bird friend. Cause see, look, I, I need my bird friend for, for something. I get a bird friend thing. Oh man, there are all sorts of porcupines over here. That one's dead. Is there anything over there? I don't know. I gotta be on the lookout for secrets. And we're at the end of the level. Um, I don't think I have any way to actually hurt you, fat bird. But I got a freaking... Droopy flag! No! That's what I wanted to do. That's not what I wanted to do. At the same time. Let's actually, you know, not immediately run into the claptrap. That might be a, a good plan. If you ask me, I just, you know, good plans are are often the best of plans. To be perfectly honest, you know, you, you gotta have good plans if you wanna have good life. Well, I, uh, I turned the bird into something. Except I lost it immediately because it happened off screen. Uh, gosh dang it. <laughs> What's in you, bird? The G. Alright, well kind of forgot that I didn't have that, so... <laughs> that answers that question. Wait. Oh. Okay. I didn't expect that. Oh, it was a balloon. I, I thought it would be something else. Oh, it's up there. Freaking heck, man. Freaking heck, man. I've been spending a whole lot of time looking for you, Mr. Bonus Barrel. This is all the way back near the beginning of the stage, by the way. Uh, so, heck yeah for that. <laughs> uh, this bonus level requires you to ride barrels to collect green bananas. It is a very exciting venture, you know, it's one of those things where you gotta just go with the punches. I don't know why you gotta go with the punches, after all. I mean, punches have the potential to hurt, man. Nobody wants to be hurt. Being hurt is bad. Spending, like, 20 minutes looking for a single bonus stage is also bad. Freaking heck, man. 
Like, I, sometimes that bird actually drops a bonus barrel, by the way. Um, which is why I was kind of fixated on that for a bit. Uh, but, uh, details, I guess. I have no idea how long this episode is, because it took me far too long to look for that. So I'm gonna end it here, just to be safe. Might be a short one. I'm sorry. Uh, next time, uh, we're going to a house, looks like. Yeah! I'll see you later and goodbye.